They jump at him. They fight back. Fight back. Fight back. He literally walked in the room. He walked in the room. Looked at everybody. Said, I dare one of y'all try something. They tried something. Killed everybody and then dipped. He didn't even kill them. He just tortured them pretty much and then dipped. Because they were too weak. They gon' get some. Bitch, I eat a lot. I want some money. I want some money. I want some money. What's up, y'all? This is the TC channel. Touching every corner of the world. What's up? We got Rock. What's good, y'all? And it's your boy Nerd. So today we're gonna be reacting. So Omni Man's had Black Air Force's activity by CJ the Champion. Before we start this video, man, we just want y'all to like and subscribe, bro. You know what I'm saying? We steady working. We're gonna keep on making these videos. And we just want y'all to, you know, be part of the team, be part of the group, you know what I'm saying? T C the game. We gotta keep on dropping vids. Put some vids in the car in the um what do you call it? The comment, bro. Piss a vision in the comments for us to watch, bro. You know what I'm saying? Send some funny vids, too. Don't say anything that's going to make us be over here silent. Just like, just like, you know, what's up with the fans and stuff. You know what I'm saying? But, to the video, though. <laughs> He just duck slaps Rex, bruh. I enjoyed that shit way too much. Play that shit again. Alright, y'all, so I watched Invincible. And after finishing this show, I only got one thing to say, bruh. This man, Omni Man, has pure Black Air Force activity. Yes, damn it, I said it. J. Jonah Jameson has finally showed us his true power. My God almighty, Peter Parker, your ass best get to step it. Because J. Jonah Jameson is not playing any more games, bruh. But anyways, yo, this man, Omni Man, is a pure savage. Like, I have never seen something like this before. And after watching this, I might have to do something, bro. I just might have to put this man in the round table of Black Air Force activity. Now, I know Invincible's not an anime, but pff, shit, we might have to make an exception. So y'all already know I got the evidence on deck. And we will see if this man is worthy to be sat at the round table of Black Air Force activity. But before we start our investigation, let me go ahead and give out that spoiler warning real quick. If you have not seen Invincible, do not watch this video. Because you will be spoiled. But like for real though, if you have not seen this show, I highly recommend <laughs> in all honesty, it's one of the best shows I've seen in a minute. But anyways, <clears throat> Exhibit A. This man murked the entire bootleg Justice League or the Guardians of the Globe, whatever the fuck you want. My nigga, they the bootleg Justice League. I mean, look at some of these niggas, bro. We got bootleg Flash, bootleg Wonder Woman, bootleg Batman, bootleg Aquaman, but he's a whole ass musty ass stank ass fish. Then we got bootleg Martian Manhunter. And then I don't know who the fuck this supposed to be. I'm just calling green bitch. Then we got this nigga. I don't know who the fuck this supposed to be either. But yo, this man, Omni Man, hold every single last one of they asses, dog. Like, look what he did to bootleg Flash, bro. He crushed his head slowly. And while he was doing that, he was trying to punch him, but he was breaking his hands while doing it. And what makes this worse, this shit probably felt like an eternity for him. So he just face plants Walmart woman, and he grabs bootleg Batman out of the fucking air and slams his ass on the canvas. And then green bitch just got annihilated. Like he put That's his crazy. whole hand through her That's face, crazy. then used Bro. her as a body shield. Then he just clobbers Aqua nigga and got his ass ready to be stuck in a fresh can bro hey, when i up, when i bro. tell you that no one saw that coming this nigga literally he literally just at the end, it was the end of the episode he just everything was so normal he comes in and kills them just murks every one of them bro he bro like look at this shit hey but look though they did start jumping them though but then he rips off Martian Manhunter. Good checks this nigga so hard he blew his back out. Sent Walmart woman back to the Great Value Isle. And sent this nigga pack her back to Valhalla. So yeah, uh, that's exhibit A. Uh, on to exhibit B. 
This man destroyed an entire alien civilization. So these aliens are attacking Earth and shit, right? So this man, Omni-Man, comes in, right? Makes them go back to their portal and retreat. But Omni-Man said, fuck that, nigga, y'all ain't going nowhere. So he flew through their portal to their planet and murked the entire civilization. And he did this shit in like the matter of seconds. And to top it off, bruh, they literally made him a portal so he could leave and go back to Earth. But to thank him for that, he decided to drop a big ass rock on their asses. Then just leave. <laughs> Bro. And the thing is, bro, in this episode, he said something that should have sent off red flags for, like, everybody. You don't seem to understand Earth isn't yours to conquer. <laughs> this man said Earth isn't yours to conquer. So in my head, I was like, hmm, wait a damn minute. Something ain't right here. But Lord have mercy, bro. This shit was just getting started. But before we go into exhibit C, our final exhibit, we're gonna take a little detour real quick because we got a little special exhibit. So without further ado, let's run exhibit S. We gotta talk about Battle Beast. All right, I know this is a Omni-Man video, but y'all know damn well I was gonna talk about this nigga. This man is a absolute savage. This dude literally bodied everybody's shit. This dude literally came to Earth only because he thought they had worthy opponents, bro. Uh, but obviously, uh, them niggas were not worthy for shit. Look how he just bitch slaps Rex, bruh. I enjoyed that shit way too much. Play that shit again. Uh, uh, obviously, if you cannot tell, I do not like Rex. Well, I mean, he ain't as bad as Amber, though. Jesus Christ! Her ass belongs to these streets, bruh. Uh, this girl literally came out of nowhere. And he started dating her and everything. And then she he's trying to say the world. So every two seconds, like she's yeah. like, oh, let's go on a date. He's like, ah, oh, yeah. I got to cut late because I got to do this shit. And then she realized that she figures out he's Omni-Man. And then he tells her, like, oh, I'm, 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 I mean, I'm invincible. And her reaction is, I don't give a fuck. She was like, you should have been there for me. He was out there rescuing niggas. She was like, I'm sorry, you still should have been there. That nigga should be. Well, you know, but you know what? It That's for a whole nother video, bro. Awesome. Look how he just smacks this nigga, bro. Sent his ass to oblivion. <laughs> this was when I realized there is no plot armor in this show at all. And he bathed in his blood, my guy. Oh, bro. And look at this no power having ass looking nigga right here. Like, the fuck is your stupid ass gonna do, dog? You deserve to get your wrist broke. Like, you just yeah, saw the strongest dude in the room get body. Like, what bright idea went through your head when you thought of this? I have no powers. The strongest dude in the room with powers just got body. What should I do? Boomer his ass. Up, and, yeah. <laughs> and then Monster Girl tried to attack him, but he sent her ass to the Shadow Room immediately. And this man got so bored because they were so damn weak, he left. Absolute savagery, bro. So that was our special exhibit. exhibit he S and, uh, it is time. He in the room. Looked at everybody, said, I dare one of y'all to try something. They tried something, killed everybody, and then dipped. He didn't even kill them. He just tortured them pretty much and then dipped because they were too weak. Ridiculous, bro. And we back. Omni-Man, Omni-Man, Omni-Man. Okay, so the entirety of Exhibit C is basically the entirety of Episode 8. But some stuff happened before that real quick. So some dudes tried to run up on him, but he murdered every single one of them. He broke Homeboy's spine. And then the immortal dude came back to life just to get his ass clapped and sent back to Valhalla again. So then we finally figure out what these Viltrumites actually are. They are not like Kryptonians. Everything Omni-Man said from day one from the jump was a damn lie. These niggas are Saiyans. They got a whole ass empire and everything, dog. So after he told all this to his son, he called his wife a pet. What? I do love your mother, but she's more like a, a pet. Oh, oh. He called his wife a pet. Oh my god, bro. This actually kind of hurt me a bit too. I was like, damn. How you gonna call your own wife a pet, G? So after that, he just starts beating the dog shit out of Mark. But then these jets come to like, what, stop him or something? What the fuck are jets going to do to this nigga? Like, these dudes are literally sitting ducks. So obviously, they get murked. I feel bad for that one dude though, bro. He got saved and everything. He was like, oh my god, I'ma live hip hip hooray. Almost killed him. Instead, you saved him. So much effort. For what? 
Yo. Bro. Hey, yo, RIP the background character 985 C, man. Then he decks his ass all the way to the city. And then, oh, bro, bro, bro. The train, the goddamn train. I'm not going to do that. When I first saw this scene, I started screaming. Bro. He used him as a meat shield. To literally kill everybody on that train. Oh, bro, bro. This, this scene right here just had me like shook. Me and all the homies were just sitting on the couch like, damn. He, he really just did that. Used his own son as a meat shield. Then he slams his ass through a carnival cruise ship. Then threw his ass to the Arctic. Caused a whole ass avalanche. Then this is where the real ass whooping began. What 17 more years? Yeah. I can always start again. Yeah. Make another kid. Yeah. Yeah. This man really said, I can always make another kid. Oh my God. How do you tell your son that? Then he just ground and pounded his face until he turned his face into a goddamn piece of meatloaf. And then obviously, of course, we get our world famous meat. You're fighting so you can watch everyone around you die. Think, Mark. Ooh, Jesus Christ, bro. Okay, um, y'all, I'm gonna have to make an exception. Omni Man will be the first outside anime character to enter the round table of Black Air Force activity. I, I, I can't deny this. This is pure savagery on another level in hell. You know what? All that battle beast in that hole, too. My God, yo. But anyways, um, man, Invincible, this show deserves all the praise, man. I was not expecting this. I thought it was gonna be just a generic ass superhero show. But my God, man, this blew that out the water. So, man, I, I can't wait for season two and three, man. It's, it's gonna be fire, bro. But anyways, y'all go ahead, take it easy, man, and I'm gonna go ahead and head out. So the question, the question I gotta ask you is, who you think winning, Superman or Arnie Man? I mean, like, uh, there's certain things, there's certain, Superman, he, like, he kind of, like, the dude that, like, he's super powerful because no one else is. So, so he, he has, like, a, he has a set of rules that, that not, that bro is not going to follow. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So, I feel like at, at a certain point, Superman's going to have to, like, sacrifice himself because bro, bro's going to be killing so many innocents. Like, Superman can't handle this. Yes, he see, he see some innocent niggas getting killed. Yeah, he don't he kill might be like, all right, bro, you got it, bro. Damn. Damn. And plus, Superman got a weakness. He got that kryptonite. Funny man, he just slapped around. He's dumb. Bro, bro was just dumb, strong, bro. I ain't know. I ain't been watching the show, bro. But it's decent, bro. For sure. But whatever y'all think we win, put it at the bottom. Uh, this will be in the video. We will put all description at the bottom so y'all know. Like he said, if y'all got any more videos you want us to watch, go ahead and recommend it in the comments and, and everything follow, like that. Follow, follow, the, follow the TC socials, man. You know what I'm saying? We always doing TC work. Follow the um the YouTube, bro. Follow the Instagram, bro. Spit things inside the chat that y'all want to see us do, bro. Look on, bro. Still. TC. I want some money. I want some money. <laughs> I want some more. I want some more.